In this video, I'm going to show you how to check for water damage on a Samsung Galaxy S2 LTE model number SGH I727R. The first and easiest way is to look at that sticker right there. Mine's red because it's water damaged. It should be white if it's not water damaged. Um, that's one of the external ways as, as well as the sticker on the battery. Again, should be white. This one has a bit of a bit of a pink tinge to it because it has touched water. So those are the two easiest ways. Now if you want to take it apart and look inside it, what you do is take out the screws on the back. There, 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 and up on the top. And then uh, mine's already taken apart, but you just run a safe pry tool around the edge here between the front bezel and the back housing. So then it comes off like that. That red sticker is the back for the one that you can see when you just take the back off. Now you can look around for corrosion and stuff. Mine shows a watermark right, right there. But uh, there's one more sticker. It is under this black antenna piece, I would call it. I'm not sure actually what it is. But you have to take one screw out there. Then you kind of pop it off. Use a safe pry tool to do it. Mine's already kind of off, so it just comes off like that. And it's the, other, the last sticker is on the back of here. It's that sticker right there. Now, I don't think the water touched this sticker, so it didn't activate. But it is purple X's with a white background. The background would be probably purple if it was water damaged. If not, it would be discolored or red. But it wouldn't be pure white like mine. And yeah, that's how you check. Thanks for watching.